and a couple of other good scoring opportunities. The first one I think we're going to see here is the goal by Gaudet. Yeah, have a look. What a nice pass across that Watling to Gaudet there. Tolchinski to Waltling to Tolchinski to yeah. Gaudet. And there Seal it is. It. He finishes no problem. You know, easy finish for him. And you know, Windsor goalie, no chance. Watch a quick move to the left and then to the right on the backhand, Cuckoo. And that was a shorthanded one. Well, watch this move for, for a defenseman. What a nice move on a real good goalie. And that completely uh, uh, Deke Murray out. And here's a pretty good scoring opportunity. Kushni making a nice save on Andrew Fritch, and then Fritch missing the rebound. Here's Jenkins with an opportunity, and that one was stopped. At the other end, uh, Murray has to come up big on Pobrozniak. Here's a big goal here. What a move there by, by Jared McCann. Again, like Tolchinski, he's one of their go-to guys, and your key, key, key players have to be at their best in games like this. And, you know, that was just a beautiful play by McCann. What a great individual effort. And guys late getting to him, and there you see the result, Jared McCann with the uh, go-ahead goal to put the Greyhounds up by a count of 2-1. to one. As we show you, only one goal scored, but there were certainly opportunities at both ends. Yeah, have a look here. There's a bit of a turnover in McCann. He, he's not a guy you want to turn that over to. He really tried to beat him short side there, and back on the spits, what an opportunity that was there. There's the elbow to Ganley. He gets away oh. with that. I mean, <laughs> that's right on the button nice. there, and he got away with one, and look at Goddad. He has been so, so good and so dangerous on the each and every shift out. Got a, 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 a real nice stop there. Look at Godet. There he is around and shot there, and that was a toe save. This is the goal, I think, is, uh, oh no, this is saved by Murray as Ben Johnson let it go. Here comes Giftopoulos, and there's Murray with another save. Now, Mr. Hosang here, starts goal to get here. Into the game. Watch his pass. Beautiful pass. Hosang, a great play behind the net. I mean, this kid here, Hosang, he's one of the more elite and dynamic forwards in the league. I mean, not much room there to pass the post being in the way. And he put it right on the tape. And Vale, who's a great finisher, he finished. Uh, indeed, it was an exciting one as we take a look here. The game is tied 2 2. Now, uh, here's shot there that Murray makes a nice save on, one of his many of that period. Here's, Here's the big save here. Yeah, that was the one on Povarozniak that could have made it 3-2 in favor of the Windsor Spitfires. And this time it's Giftopoulos going in tight, maybe a little too tight. As Another big stop there. Yep. Yeah. Now the Greyhounds back the other way. Gaudet sets it up. Ganley lets the shot go, and there's your winning goal is uh, Tyler Ganley, who had the puck bounce off his body in last night for the winning goal and for Guelph. And there's Darnell Nurse with a blast. I think he surprised everybody there, including yeah, me. That, that was kind of a weak goal, but yeah. I think that that really had to be demoralizing. I mean, Nurse did not get a whole lot on that, and he, you know the goalie's got to make that save, especially in a game like this. And here's Gaudet again, and what an outstanding Look game at that he pass. had. <laughs> Look at that pass. I mean, you know Don Maloney again, the GM for Phoenix Coyotes in town, and you know Gaudet signed with the Coyotes. I'll tell you what, Maloney, he's probably on the phone right now <laughs> saying. Boy, oh boy, we may have a dandy here in Goddard. Playing very well offensively and defensively. Just a complete player, and he's had an outstanding.